Hey, how's it going guys? Phil here, and this is a review for the Beko Vacuum Sealer Rolls. You'll receive four identical vacuum seal bag rolls. Each roll has an 11 inch width and 3 inch diameter, with 20 feet of length. If you have a vacuum sealer inside of which you can store the bags, make sure you check the max diameter of the roll that can be used so you know that this one fits. On the side of each roll is an arrow sticker to help you quickly find the edge for unrolling. As you can see, the bags have two different textured sides. One side has a rough diamond texture, while the other side is smooth and transparent. You'll also notice that there is no printing on these bags. No brand, no logo, nor length markers to help you cut identically sized bags. What I like to do is fold the end of the sheet to the size bag that I want then cut straight across the seam with a sharp pair of scissors. You can also cut the bags to length with a sharp knife. I use these bags with my Food Saver vacuum system, which can accept bags with widths up to 11 inches. To create a bag from the cutoff piece, you'll first need to seal one side of it. Then place your food inside to preserve, marinate, or prepare it for sous vide cooking. Here I'm vacuum sealing some dried apple slices for pantry storage. The vacuum bags performed as expected, holding their seal without any leaks, even when placed on the shelf for months. I also like to use these bags for sous vide cooking. Just place your prepared food in the bag, vacuum, and seal for an airtight cook bag ready for your sous vide water bath. Note that the area where the heat seal will be needs to be clean, dry, and free of debris, as these issues could compromise the seal. After two hours submerged in the sous vide bath, there was no problem with leaking or failure of the seal. The liquid inside the bag is from the marinade. Overall, these vacuum seal bags performed just like the brand name ones, but at half the cost. They hold up on the shelf, in the freezer, and work well for sous vide. Just keep in mind that these can't be used in the microwave. I hope you enjoyed this review. You can ask me any questions in the comments. I'll put a link to the product in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and join me next time.